China's People's Liberation Army, PLA, has officially begun integrating its newest generation of 8x8 wheeled assault vehicles, marking a significant step in the ongoing modernization of its ground forces. The vehicle, designated ZTL-19, is a heavily updated derivative of the Type 19 Infantry Fighting Vehicle, IFV. This platform evolves from earlier models, notably the ZTL-11, itself developed from the Type 08 series. Visual confirmation of the ZTL-19's deployment has emerged through social media channels, including posts by the account at Jezus Froman, with footage showing military trains transporting these vehicles to frontline units, indicating a systematic rollout. The centerpiece of the ZTL-19's firepower is a cutting-edge 105mm rifled cannon engineered with advanced materials that enhance durability and accuracy while managing recoil effectively. This gun's design notably omits a muzzle brake, which decreases the firing signature and reduces recoil impact inside the crew compartment, contributing to improved safety and comfort for operators. Its ammunition compatibility spans a wide spectrum, including fin-stabilized armor-piercing discarding sabo, APDS, rounds, high-explosive anti-tank, heat, projectiles, fragmentation shells, bunker-penetrating rounds, and guided missiles launched from the barrel. The latest APDS ammunition reportedly can defeat 600mm of rolled homogeneous armor from distances up to 2 km. Meanwhile, laser-guided munitions provide precision targeting capabilities for various threats, including land, sea, and slow-moving aerial targets, with a reach of up to 5 km. The ZTL-19 is outfitted with an advanced turret featuring an autoloader and a panoramic sight system, which together deliver hunter-killer functionality allowing crews to simultaneously detect and engage multiple threats, significantly boosting combat responsiveness and battlefield awareness. Mobility enhancements are another hallmark of the ZTL-19. The chassis houses a newly developed power pack that merges a more powerful engine with an automatic transmission designed for ease of maintenance. The suspension has been upgraded for improved off-road performance. Additionally, the vehicle is equipped with twin duct water jets at the rear, enabling it to achieve amphibious speeds of 8 to 10 km per hour, which expands its operational reach in rivers and coastal zones. In terms of protection, the ZTL-19 employs a combination of high-strength steel and modular composite armor plates. With an approximate combat weight of 25 tons, it provides comprehensive 360-degree defense against 7.62mm armor-piercing bullets, frontal resistance to 14.5mm rounds, and partial protection against heavier 25mm and 30mm projectiles. The hull has been reinforced to increase resilience against mines and improvised explosive devices, IEDs, enhancing crew survivability in asymmetric threat environments. This deployment of the ZTL-19 underscores the PLA's doctrinal evolution toward wheeled armored vehicles that strike a balance between strategic mobility, firepower, and protection. Since the 1970s, wheeled platforms have grown in prominence due to their operational flexibility and reduced logistical demands over tracked alternatives. The ZTL-19's amphibious capabilities, modern armament suite, and modular construction align with China's broader strategic goals of upgrading its ground combat forces. Ultimately, the ZTL-19 epitomizes the PLA's current priorities for ground warfare, maximizing operational efficiency, adapting to diverse terrains, and maintaining rapid deployment capabilities. Its advanced weapon systems, robust armor, and enhanced mobility position it as a cornerstone in China's continuing efforts to modernize and restructure its land forces for contemporary and future combat challenges.